Hey, what is going on guys? Techside Reviews here and today I want to talk to you about web hosting because as you know, in today's society, if you've got something to say, to sell, whatever it is, you're going to need a website. And for that, you're going to need a really good web hosting provider to make sure that your traffic is managed well, that people can see it and that it is protected. So many things that make sure your website lives up to the standards of what your customers should expect from you. So like all things, web hosting services come in all shapes and sizes. And whether they're offering shared hosting, dedicated hosting, VPs, managed hosting server cores, different RAMs, CDNs, SSL certificate, it's endless. There's so many different things that these companies offer. There's just an endless amount of things that web hosting services offer to you because what everybody needs is different. So like a snowflake, there's got to be a web host out there for you that will meet the needs of whatever it is you are looking to have your website do. So no matter what it is I'm speaking about in this video, I am speaking from first hand experience, managing so many websites, too many to even count and working back into them and really vetting these out and understanding what it is that meets my needs. And of course, you know, I'm going to have some recommendations for you of what I feel are the best options out there for you for a number of reasons related to overall quality, budget, speed, performance, all of these different things and more. And once again, please check the description for links to everything that I talk about here in this video, as well as some coupon codes or discounts that might be available to save you money. So with that being said, leading off the pack today is going to be Bluehost. And it's one of the most popular and best choices for web hosting, period. They've been around for a long time. They've got great hosting at an amazing price and have really, really good reputation for supporting their customers. I've used the customer support and it is absolutely great. If you get stuck or have any problem, they have a 24 seven support by phone or live chat. So yeah, yeah, that is pretty cool because most or a lot of services have live chat only available uh, sometimes, okay? You can actually talk to a human being with Bluehost. So there's no hoops to jump through or anything like that. And they list the support number in live chat right on the sites. You can reach it in a couple of clicks. No Googling and looking in questions to find out what the answer is and hoping that is right. They've got you covered there. They also offer fantastic analytics and SEO tools to make sure that you get visibility for your site, optimize it to make sure that performance and attracts a lot of visitors. And that SEO tools was actually cool because it scores and tracks how well your website is ranking for specific keywords. So it gives you a good idea of how you should optimize your site for the best search rankings. They also offer hosting that will support whatever direction your business grows. So let's just say, for example, you go with the standard shared hosting plan and then want to install WordPress. Well, they have a very easy one click install to make that happen. And then if your site keeps growing and growing and growing and you want to upgrade to managed WordPress hosting to speed up your site, improve your security and all of that jazz, they have that too. Or if you just want to get more control by upgrading to a VPS or a dedicated hosting service, they have plans for both of those too. So the point is overall Bluehost covers everything you could possibly need. Okay. Uh, it is my number one overall top choice for us uh, because yeah, everything you possibly need from a host for you and whatever you're trying to do on the internet, Bluehost will cover it. And that's also what really makes them perfect for beginners. So if you have a fledgling idea, let's say, you, I don't know, you know, you have something that you really want to get out there and get and start selling or whatever it is you're trying to do with it. Uh, well, you're going to need to create a website and Bluehost is going to do a really great job with that. Okay. It's going to make it very, very easy for you. You feel comfortable doing what you're doing and knowing that you're doing it well without having to feel like you're behind everybody else that's already accomplished these things. I know some of us out there though are a little bit more budget conscious. So with this next top choice and this, that's going to be hosting Hostinger is one of the most affordable web hosts out there right now. 
How affordable do you ask? Well, take a look at this. Their lowest plan starts at less than a dollar per month. Okay, 99 cents per month. That is like the same price as a value menu item at a food fast food restaurant. So for a single buck, you can go off and start using Hostinger. Uh, but just remember, all of these rates that they have available to you are promotional. So they will go up when you renew uh, at a later date, okay? so. I would definitely recommend locking in to one of these longer subscriptions. Maybe do like two years or three years or something because for $36, uh, you could get Hostinger at 99 cents per month. It's gonna be around $36 for three years of web hosting. So if you're like, like I said, 99 cents per month, maybe drop $25 and do it for a couple of years because it will be much cheaper than some of the other places. And they offer four years of hosting for 99 cents a month if you pay for it, okay? And that is not a lot of money. 99 cents a month for four years of hosting is an absolute steal. So dropping as much as 50 bucks could cover you for full, uh, a full four years. It sounds risky, but honestly, it's a really, it's, it's just such good value. Uh, so that's where hosting comes in. And even after the promotional pricing ends, uh, it is still a super, super low price. The single site plan only costs $2.15 a month, which is one of the lowest in the industry and the best uh, bang for your buck hosting, okay? Uh, it doesn't feel like cheap hosting either from the marketing to the user interface for managing the site. It feels like you're dealing with something that is a little bit more higher end, uh, to be honest, okay? The site speeds and the support and the uptime are all very, very good as well, okay? They have a 99.9% .9 uptime guarantee along with 24-7 support whenever you need help. So you shouldn't expect hosting it to be quite as good as these other web hosts because it is only a dollar, but honestly, for the value of a dollar, it is absolutely unbeatable. All right, and lastly, we all know how keeping up with this world requires speed and performance being just fast. So our last top choice today is going to be SiteGround. Now SiteGround is normally $14.99 a month, and they have a free SSL and email CDN backups. They're, they're recommended by WordPress themselves, and they do have a 30-day money-back guarantee. And one thing that SiteGround comes with uh, that a lot of web hosts don't is a rabid fan base and glowing review. So 93% of the people that use SiteGround rated as excellent, okay, five stars. Their reputation is absolutely stellar. And along with Bluehost, SiteGround and Bluehost represents two of WordPress top three recommended web hosts, okay? So WordPress hosting is built into all of its shared hosting plans. So what that means is you'll get automatic updates, streamlined security, and expert level technical support. In fact, SiteGround's infrastructure is fully optimized for WordPress users to have access to their suite of WordPress features, such as their WP Startup plugin, which helps you easily build a website, which I will maybe cover in a future video. And where they really, really shine is their shared hosting, okay, their shared web hosting. SiteGround servers are ultra fast and ultra secure, and they're constantly deploying new updates all the time to keep them that way. So the highest tier plan, the Go Geek, aptly titled, is just absolutely souped up with different tools. Developers will find especially useful, including a staging server. Lots of small businesses and personal websites will probably find this a bit overkill. You just won't need that much. But if your needs are more complex than the basics, SiteGround has a lot to love. There is one downside, however, once you blow through SiteGround's introductory pricing, your plan will explode. For example, the lowest tier jumps from seven bucks to 15, and the highest goes from $15.40, and that doesn't feel great, okay? In fact, it's kind of funny because you remember the 93% excellent, well, all of the one-star reviews were based upon the fact that the pricing jumped up so much after the promotional period. And it is quite significant, to be honest. And they're also one of our top picks for cloud hosting as well. So if there's a chance you think you might need to upgrade to some serious hosting power, 
once you start generating all that super duper traffic, SiteGround is an absolutely great option that makes upgrading a really, really easy thing to do later. And their customer support, as I said, they're available across all channels, phone, chat, email, and they really know what they're doing. SiteGround also has the most transparent uptime. It's 99.9% .9 annual uptime guarantee, or you get a month of free hosting, okay? So that could work to your advantage. If you have that $15 plan that bumps to up to 40, that's a free 40 bucks in your pocket. And SiteGround is very, very good at keeping you updated as to what it is to make sure they're not cheating you on that. So guys, there we go. That, that you have it now. Those are the three top web hosting that I would recommend anyone to start using, okay? Uh, if you're a beginner looking to get your fledgling idea out there into the world and you're looking to make a website, any one of these web hosts are gonna be absolutely perfect for you, okay? Bluehost, Hostinger, SiteGround, three of my top choices uh, for right now, okay? If you would like more videos just like this, okay, about web hosting and all sorts of other content, please feel free to subscribe. It is completely free to do. And also, please do not forget to smash that like button. Really, really helps out the YouTube algorithm and I very, very much appreciate it. But as for this video, guys, that is the best web hosting providers for WordPress and shared hosting in 2021 and beyond. Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you in the next video.